What's going on everyone? It's TG Smooth back with some more Ark Survival Evolved. Playing on the Scorched Earth map. Hanging out with Malachi today, but I hope you guys are having a good day. I'm having a pretty good day. It's it's been good. We've we've had some shits and giggles taming this moth. Anyway, so we went out find a found found find a found a 108 moth and we got it tamed up. So I think today we're gonna hit up one of the artifact caves. Um, if you watched the first couple episodes, it was the one right across our little underground base. Um, yeah, so that's what we got planned today, and maybe if we got time, we'll hit up a second one. But I know this little guy can squeeze through the, um, uh, one of the cave entrances inside the cave to go down and get the artifact. So we're definitely going to need a moth, and then we're going to bring one of the Argents with us, um just to clear out the cave so right now I'm just what are you roasting back there what, what's, what's going on just killing a few sabos I can't believe I can hear that from this far away holy crap <laughs> loud yes <laughs> just the the sound of searing flesh you know <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I love that meat. Mm. So, <laughs> yeah, we're we're just headed to our little starter base right now. I'm gonna leave this guy there, and then we're gonna go head back to the main base and grab the Argent. Um, Malachi's gonna take the Wyvern back, and then we're, we'll take a real quick break so we don't burn uh, that much time, and we'll bring you back whenever we're ready to go splunking. <laughs> And we're back. Alright, so we're at the cave at about 60 lat and 45 long, I think. Let me check here. Yeah, so 60 lat, 45 long. Um, it's right across from our main base from the other server. And we're just clearing out this area. Farting on people. Alright, I'm getting levels off you. That's awesome. And stamina. Ugh. Let me go fart on him for you. I got you, buddy. Ugh. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. There you go. They should be super slowed, so the moss are not the best mount in the world, but they work really well for this cave. And then let's go ahead and level up a little bit of HPs. And just... Ugh. Dang, that was a pretty high level Titan bow there <laughs> oh the amount of levels Gotta land. I'm gaining off of you right now <laughs> oh here comes the Titan bows I want I want nothing to do with that stop hitting me Back up here now, get stamina. Moment. I don't think this is very effective against like bugs and insects. It don't look like it's slowing them down any. So many. Nah, it's not really slowing them down, but you get experience share for me killing them after you do that, so. <laughs> Which is okay, gonna I make don't leveling pick these up. guys up pretty difficult. So besides, like, players, I don't see much of a use for the moss. Besides, like, for, for PvP slowing players down and, like, getting in these caves.
and farting on everything. Got to land again. All right. Some <laughs> guys uh, draining my stamina. Got to land a little more often. Ugh. Don't fly down there. Well, you're getting all the action, man. There, there's not much I can do. Oh, I know. I can just tell you when I gotta land, so you know that. Oh my god, I think that mantis hit my physical persons, because destroyed all my armor instantly. Yeah, the, well, not the mantis, but the uh, little centipedes do that. They, they oh, do they? Yeah, they shoot stuff at you. We gotta tame some of these. I don't think we've tamed any of the Arthropleuras. Ooh, yeah, it just one shot like all of my flak and everything. That's nasty. They're coming after you though. We'll never catch I'm trying to get them, but I can only kill them one at a time. One at a time. I mean, I could go ahead. Yeah, while you're out here clearing the path, I think I'm pretty good. I should be able to fly past everything. Ooh, here's a drop right here. Uh, it's just blue, but... <laughs> nope. Definitely need you to clear that area. Alright. Finally. It was 108. Horrible time to poop. Yeah, it took all of my armor out with one shot. <coughs> so guys, this is going to take a little bit of time, so we're going to go ahead and clear this area out, and we'll BRB. Alright, so let's see what's in this nice little blue drop right here. We got a moth saddle, but that's too bad because we already got a Mastercraft moth saddle. Ooh, and that Titan bow came out of the middle of nowhere. And there's the rubble golems, or rubble elementals. Alright, I am going to fly towards the part with the um, artifact in it, Malachi. Alright, bud. There's one mantis left back here. And see what's going on over this way. Alright. So right down here I is heal. where the artifact should be. Let's go ahead and get this guy off here so he can't jump down on us. Miss me, stupid. And same with this guy. So you can fit a moth down um, in here and get this pretty easy. <coughs> oh, oh, oh. Bat Central. Oh, no, 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 no. You don't. Alright, so we'll just aggro these guys away. And hopefully they stay off of us. And we can just double back, grab that artifact, and be done with this place, because I don't like caves that too much. So I'm trying to think, if you were on foot, you would have to go across that, come down here, and probably grapple your way across to get down to this artifact, or have a parachute. No, no, can you land? Oh, thank you. And then you get the... Uh-oh. Something's happening. Um, the Scorched Earth Spike skin for the pike. Which is pretty cool. I'll show you guys here in a few. And then sometimes down here... Um, could be a red drop. 
right in this area right here. I know it's hard to see. Holy crap, how high can these mantises jump? So let's get out of here now. All right, Malachi, I got the artifact. I appreciate your, your help uh, getting to this point. Too bad there's no red drops down here, though. Can we get through here? Yes, perfect. All right, so looking around... I have not killed the mantis. You haven't? Oh, well, I'm done. I got yeah. the artifact and, and the skin for the pike. And then I guess we still got more time, so we're going to head to another cave. We've been in this one before, so we knew our way around. Um, haven't watched any videos over the other two caves or where they're at. I'll probably look up the location, but I don't want to see inside of them because I think that's just too big of a spoiler. And I like, I like exploring them by, like, well, not by myself, but before I watch videos on it and stuff like that. So we're going to go ahead and head over to the next one, and we'll see you there. And we're back. So Malachi cannot get through here on an RG. So I don't, <laughs> I don't know what you're going to do, Malachi. The moth fits yes, through hoof there it. perfectly. Well, maybe I can just swoop down in here, get the artifact, and get out. Because that's really all we're here for. Oh man, this one's so huge. So far, it's pretty quiet. And I'm guessing this way it doubles back to ugh, the beginning. Okay. The, There's water here. The quietness is up. Uh, buddy? I'm I'm back here by the water. Uh -huh, okay. You're, you're you're continuing to go further. Yep. Burr, 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 burr. But them bats are trapped. Ooh. There's rubble going. Oh my god! And there's water in here. I don't like caves with water. I do not like caves with water whatsoever. Nothing around this way. And let's get some stamina real quick. I got all these bats chasing me. Crap. Whee! <laughs> We're out of there. Alright. Oh no, don't land there. Definitely don't land there. Oh man, this is scary. Here's the artifact. We found it. Oh. Oh, this ain't good. We're gonna have to, like, get everything out of here. And then try to come back through. Especially the bats. Maybe like the scorpions and stuff we can handle. Because all we would have to do is sit up on that ledge. And then um, just shoot them with our shotgun. I did bring a shotgun and like 50 bullets with me. Well close to 50 bullets. Alright. I gotta fly far away from these guys. Holy crap. This moth cannot outrun. Poop. Alright, am I good right here? Yeah. Alright, let's see if we can lose them around this way. And then. Hopefully these mantises just kind of leave us alone. Nope. Oh, fly away. Fly. I said fly.
Hey, you guys. Come on. Come out this way. <laughs> so this this is going to be a challenge. Oh my god, there's so much stuff down here. It's not even funny at this point, and we're getting super low on stamina. Alright, we should be safe right here. Now, I'm pretty sure all the drops are going to be, like, down in the water uh, for some reason. And it don't look too safe down there, so I'm not comfortable with trying to look for drops right now. We just want the artifact and to see if it gives you a different skin or whatever the case may be. Alright, so these guys don't even want to come out of this area. Hmm... If I could just kill that one Manus. Or get him out of here. Uh oh. Uh oh. I'm jumped. Oh, they jumped me. Sh crap. You can do it, little moth. Alright, come this way, guys. Yeah. All right, come on. Oh, it's hostile down here, Malachi. You're missing out on all the excitement. <laughs> yeah, that's what you like to call it. <laughs> it's exactly what it is. Right, so we're gonna have to hurry. Mm. We got it! <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. Holy crap, I can't believe we did that. We juked them all! <laughs> Look at all of them. They're just waiting there to kill me. All right, we're out of here. Screw this place. I don't. I don't like this cave. This is. This is by far a lot more dangerous than the other one we were in. So, um, hopefully, we never have to come back here. And hopefully, we can still get out as well. I need to stop flying so low. That's pretty stupid on my part. And then I didn't even see any drops. Anything over this way, maybe? Nope. Whew. I see the RG's name. Oh, thank you. I'm out of here. <laughs> oh, man, that place was... That was crazy. Alright, so that is actually a scorched torch skin. You know what, Malachi? Since you are like the torch guy, I present this gift to you. Alright. I'm, I'm kind of curious to see what it looks like. Uh, we're going to head back to base. This is um, all the cave diving we're going to do for one day. Maybe we'll hit up the third cave tomorrow. Um, we'll go back to base. I'll show these skins off to you guys. And then we'll call it a day from there. So we'll see you then. Finally back at base. Alright, so this pike is bigger than me. So don't laugh. But that looks freaking amazing. Look at it. It actually looks like it has like a tongue coming out of it. And then let's go ahead and check out the torch skin. Ah, it's alright. Is that bones? Or? Not too bad. I mean, it's it's something new, which is always good. So uh, a little bit went on like off camera whenever we got done building the base. I got all the mantises 
Still only got like one egg from these guys and the egg interval is like cranked up to 10 times. And then check it out on the inside we got our vaults down, our fabricator, bookshelves, all of our storage. It gets really super hot in here so I had to put a bunch of ACs. We got the industrial grill, the fridge now, a bunch of mortar and pestles, and then the industrial forge as well so a lot's happened since then and I don't understand even with this off whenever I walk into this room it, it just gets hot sometimes um, so it's pretty weird I don't I don't know if that's like a new bug or something like that and then of course we got the auto turrets up and then I think we got a bunk bed and stuff up here as well we're still not quite done with this base. Like I said, I have a lot planned for it. But that's it for today, guys. Thanks for coming and hanging out with me. If you did like the video, don't forget to smash that thumbs up button for me. And subscribe for more videos like this. But as usual, this is TG Smooth out. And remember to stay smooth.